welcome to the DB Kofer Technology Center in Carrollton, Georgia. First opened in 1992, our 50,000 square foot facility serves as Southwire's on-site research and development center staffed with more than 50 industry experts dedicated to delivering innovation in wire and cable design, metallurgy and compound technology. Our team also includes the experts and labs in Bremen, Indiana and Lincolnshire, Illinois. In each of these facilities, meeting real-world customer needs with efficient, economical and innovative solutions begins with advanced research. Again, welcome. DB Peak Kofer, the namesake for the Kofer Center, joined Southwire in 1953 after graduating from Georgia Tech with a degree in mechanical engineering. One of his first tasks was to assemble the famed Properzi machine, a rod mill that arrived with instructions written in Italian and whose many pieces were scattered in various crates and boxes across a warehouse floor. This challenge did not deter Kofer, and within three months, the machine was continuously producing shiny coils of aluminum rod to be drawn and stranded into cable. He would later repeat this process, striking a deal with Western Electric and working with a heavy-duty steel rolling mill from Morgan Construction Company to produce the continuous casting technology for copper rod. These feats, and many more, would eventually help Kofer become Southwire's Vice President of Research and Development, a board member, and, ultimately, its Chief Engineer. The most important title anyone could have in a 5,000-person, technology-driven company. In March 1997, Kofer retired after a 44-year career with Southwire, and in September of that same year, he passed away. Despite his passing, Pete Kofer's legacy lives on at the world-class research and development facility that bears his name. We are an ISO 17025 and globally recognized A2LA accredited laboratory, specializing in the chemical, electrical, and mechanical fields. And our focus revolves around four key areas, compound technology, advanced materials, advanced transmission technology, and new product development. Within our facility, we have four polymer labs, each equipped with high quality analytical instruments used for testing and improving our products. In our wet chemistry lab, we conduct halogen acid gas, hardness, and solvent extraction testing. And our analytical lab has the tools needed to identify and characterize insulation, shielding, and jacket materials. Our aging lab tests cables for heat, sunlight, weather, oil, and gasoline resistance, and our team in the Physical Properties Lab can determine a wide range of characteristics, including tensile strength, elongation, flammability, and more. In addition to these polymer labs, our facility also boasts a compound extrusion area, an overhead conductor mechanical test lab, cable life testing area, qualification test area, and a high voltage test lab, featuring a 400 kV transformer, torsion tester, and an impulse generator capable of generating 1.2 million volts to simulate a lightning strike. The metallurgy services that our team offers include the use of an optical emission spectrometer and a scanning electron microscope. Our talented team of metallurgists, polymer chemists, process and applications engineers, and more are always working on many projects simultaneously to add value to our business and provide solutions to our customers. But that doesn't keep us from giving back to the local community or participating in our company's worthwhile initiatives. Kofer Center employees remain active in Project Gift, volunteering at events like the annual Back to School Giveaway. We're part of the organization's FUSE initiative through our involvement with many of the employee resource groups, and Axel Schlumberger serves as the executive sponsor of the Allied ERG. Through regular safety meetings and routine quality checks, our team also stays committed to our company's goal of creating and maintaining a culture of zero. So, that's a quick look at the DB Kofer Technology Center here in Carrollton, Georgia. We are thankful for the opportunity to welcome you to our facility today and to share the story of our operations and our people. <laughs>